Hello there and welcome back to Let's Play Racketeer in Item Shop's Tale. I am the RN Genius, but you may call me Eric. And today there is a very special episode. Let me... Let me tell you. Reading is reaching an all-time high of popularity among young women. What does that mean? We're gonna stack up our game. Step up, not stack up. That, that would be weird if we're stacking up our game. Anyways, today we're gonna make a lot of experience. Um, why is that? Well, we're buying a bunch of books and... Um, yep. I've got a bunch of each one, now a few more, okay, okay, just till we spend 50,000 on books, and a few more of these expensive ones, and then we go back to the stop. Ah, there's an event here. This is not the event music, is it? Ah, oh, maybe it is. Hello! Ah, little Rashid, working hard, I hope! Are you out on a walk, sir? That I am! I make a habit of getting out of this house on days like this. Walking in the sun like this is good for the soul. Ah, yes. Clear days to, uh, do feel nice. You stay indoors during periods of inclement weather then? Haha, <laughs> no, sun's good for the soul, but rain hardens the body. Sides. It's nice to see that city looking different on a rainy day. So then you just go for a walk every day. Well, I guess if you gotta I guess if you gotta be short about it, I do. Wahahaha <laughs> uh, How on earth do you find that funny as well? For, for, for the record, I find this f that funny as well. That's funny. That is so funny. That is so funny. I'd almost laugh at this. <sighs> okay, there we go. A good day is going to start now. Dun, 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 da, da, da. Why is this a good day, you might ask. Remember that time when men came in streaming? into this store. Do you remember that? I hope you remember that because that was a good day. That was a day we made a lot of profit and that was a day we made a lot of experience. Nah, just a lot of profit really. Um, people are into reading right now, meaning we open just, we, we are basically just the bookstore now. Okay, tables, no, change tables though. Got this legendary cup. Are you serious? Those are a couple of boxes. The legendary super counter. Line up items, use it as a desk, even hide thing, uh, things in certain um, com compartments. It's a bunch of cardboard boxes. Open the store up. Girls have come in in great numbers looking for the popular books! Welcome, what can I help you? Oh, you, you've got this cool box, yeah, but that, but do. Okay. Dun, 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 Do you have a book? Oh, you could just go walk, go looking around, but, oh, apparently I do have one. Just for you. I picked it out just for you. It is perfect for you. I'm a good chopper, right? And do you know who did not enter our shop today? Yes, indeed, the combo breaker lady. Oh, for your brother-in-law, huh? At least your wife didn't send you looking for sinister things, because that apparently happens sometimes. Oh my god, so many people in our store. I love it. It's right now it's not even about the about the experience. It's about this combo. If we keep it going, oh man, we are gonna be in a world of not hurt, but good places. Ooh. Didn't didn't get the near pin there though. Well, they bought all the books that weren't even 
Oh, you're a cooker, huh? The popular books. <laughs> Men come, st come streaming into your store looking for the popular sinister things. Oh, hey, my wife asked me to get something sinister for our, uh, like, how do you call that, uh... Marriage day, the, our, um, uh, why can't I remember the word? I don't can help for them. <laughs> why? Darn. Oh, what can I get you? Oh, a present for your brother. Anyway, let's not talk about that ever again. Near pin there. Cool. A lot of XP. Come on, just keep buying the books. Keep buying the books. Oh, we have a book. Oh, we have a book for you. We've got quite a few books. I would have sold you that. That have you heard about that book with the with the bloody battles, with the the really bloody battles and the eye uh, eye um, cutting out eye part? What? Wait, what? This year's harvest uh, de uh, is harvest uh, disaster. The price of food has increased. The price of swords is normalized. In times of trouble, term financing will be there for you. Guess what? The boom of books does not has not ended. Completely true. I thought I would get more out of this though. Like a little bit more experience. I know it was quite a bit of experience, but I thought it went a little better. Also, yes, 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 fair point. Yes, it is a fair point. I can charge double for all my food. This is worth more, though. So, an event. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, like yeah, we're going out on an event. What? No. 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 Apparently, you can only activate that boom once. That's, that's sad. That is sad. But apparently, people like books. Oh, some food! Oh, you've come to the right place, mister. <laughs> oh, what an idiot. <laughs> okay. 1.4k should be alright. Seems about right, yeah. Yeah, right. <laughs> oh, man. I thought there would be more ladies coming in looking for the books. Two bracelets, two days. Okay, can do that. Can do that. Thank you, thank you. Oh, it's so warm in here. Oh, my God. I'm really surprised that Louie entered this uh, the store while we're selling books. Doesn't make any darn sense. You're looking for some food, huh? Oh, I've got some food right here. Although it's all food you probably cannot afford. Ah, Ectos, that's pretty good. Okay, that should be fine. Just bonus. Just bonus. Oh, you're buying a book. Man, you are a good person. You read a lot, of, eh? Probably read, read the two prequels as well. Armor is quite the character. Eh, that wasn't so successful. The price of daggers has decreased. The price of metal things has normalized. Today's saucepan index 20. What does that even mean? Alrighty. Let's... Let's. Sadly, I cannot make use of the boom twice. I think that might be the case. And then now I'm gonna. I'm just gonna switch to selling a bunch of sweets and selling a bunch of ham sandwich. I mean, I've got a lot of food, so I might as well sell it, right? But I've had it happen before. It's a candy boom. Candy's double priced, and yeah. Yeah. And I just got such a ridiculously good combo going. Oh, that was beautiful. That was t true beauty back then. But okay, this is beautiful as well. It's not like that. It's not like that. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna... No. I'm gonna charge you 6k. Near pin. Hello, combo breaker lady. You're in my store. Oh! Oh, you want that thing. Oh, I'm sorry, but that's kind of really expensive. That's not a fair deal, though. Oh, well. He seems happy about this. 
Ooh, yeah, bait jam. I think it's time to move. Fuck. She got me. She got me. Well, okay. Combo broke off. I shouldn't have bought that. Oh, well. Doesn't make a huge difference. Ah! Why are these people so smart? I'm not buying that. I'm not buying that. Da 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 da. Fuck! <laughs> oh, the game got me. Okay, okay. I tried to punch the game in the in the groin, but um, it it caught my punch and kicked me right in the f right in the kisser. Actually, sorry, no deal. I'm coming back in some time, I guess. Yeah, when the boom has ended, though. Not the boom, but, um, yeah. Finally! Finally some buyer, man. Ugh. I can't haggle too much. Yeah, you sure can't. Oh, it's so warm, though. Oh my god, why when it got, get so warm? You need a weapon! Are there overpriced weapons? No, there are no overpriced weapons. Meaning, I've got to deal with a longsword, buddy. Got to deal with a longsword today. So you really like that price, huh? That's a good price. Yeah, that is true. Oh, they didn't buy more food. Hmm. Oh well. Still good. Still good. Exceeded expectations. And we paid money. Ooh, well, sold a bunch of books, but mm, it wasn't as good as I so thought it would be. I thought I could get three booms in one day. That would have been crazy. I would have leveled up five times on that day. But I guess the game balanced that out. Too bad. Okay, I've read that out two times before, so now need... What? Ah, Rochette, a moment, if you would. The news were just gonna pop into the screen, but... <laughs> Are you down with something, Tear? No, I'm quite well. I simply thought it was time to explain how to place and use vending machines. The vending machines? Vending machines allow you to sell a larger volume of items in a shorter amount of time compared to handling each customer yourself. Really? I guess that makes sense. To place a vending machine, choose the vending machine from the item placement menu at a counter, as if it were no normal item. The counter will become that vending machine. And after I put it down, it just starts selling stuff? No! You will have to keep the machine stocked yourself. There is a limit to how much you can place in a vending machine as well. So be mindful of what you put inside. Kayo! There is, however, a downside. Because the machine is automatic, the price of an item sold from a vending machine cannot be negotiated. Items will sell for their base price. Keep that in mind. Oh, I like being able to haggle till I turn blue in the face. It is a drawback. The extra volume can often make up for the lower price, however. So for cheap items, a vending machine is helpful. Well, I guess so. Finally! Remember that we cannot sell off the machines ourselves. If you wish to dispose of a machine, we must sell it back to the Merchant's Guild or Market. At a steep loss. Keep that in mind if you decide to invest in one. Will do. News. The price of heavy armor has increased. The books boom has ended. Oh. When leaving your house, be sure and lock up. What's that about? Still overpriced, though. Uh, no event. There are no events popping up. Because oh my god, next payment to 200k, huh? That's nice. It's just nice. Are there any outstanding orders for today? Uh, Guildmaster, two pieces of armor. Wait. Armor, 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 armor. That is too bad. We can't. We can't do that, huh? Nah. 
Nah, I'm not gonna say, buy, go buy armor for him. Oh yeah, let's pu put the mermaid shoes here. Just out of spite. And then some watermelon here and another grape here. And that's about it. And then I'm gonna open the shop once and then I'm gonna go to the dungeon. But this is gonna take like five minutes and after that... Gonna end the episode. Welcome! I lower myself to buying something from you! A scarf! Oh. Can't make her buy that thing. Not bad, Rashad. Okay, buy it. Buy it. Just bonus. I don't even know what just bonus means. Oh well. Oh, hi, welcome. Do you have a bracelet? Oh my god, I do not. I don't think I have. Oh, no, I do have a lot of bracelets, actually, because they were cheap ones. Uh, I don't... Ah, oh, whatever, buy it at a base price. Why not? I'm not making any profit anyway. Near pin? How is that a near pin, though? Tch, game's weird. Go out of my store. Oh! Ah, she can charge me. She cannot charge me more money than I have in total. Meaning, this is a pretty fair deal. But. <laughs> I can haggle, can't I? How about, how about 45%? How about 45% of that thing? Okay. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. Do you have some clothes? No, you're not buying... Why are you buying clothes here? You want a rain core? Oh my god, I do not have like... <laughs> I literally have clothes. Okay, take it. Take it. Take it and leave. Oh, uh, not many people want to buy food these days. Pieces of armor you asked for. You asked for more like it. That armor? Perfect! Wow! It's just what you wanted. 100% of base price. 25. Okay. Uh, that seems fair enough. Okay. Dun, dun. Man, those were a lot of people going to my Sorry, I don't want to be paying you that stuff. Okay. Okay, good enough. Eat the mass. Okay, an event. Ah. ah enlightenment to bowl from the blue. Yeah, that'll work, no doubt at all. My genius is so profound, it's scary! Eh. Uh, shall we return home? Now hold on a sec, little fishies! I cannot conceive of this being anything other than yet another one of your ill-conceived schemes. No, 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 no! What I have in mind is business! Brilliant business! I mean, it occurred to me that I don't do much business because I'm trying to sell all this expensive stuff on my own! What I need to do is start a business and sell to my employees. And then those people sell to their employees. Who? Well, you get it. Why you could... Why? You could sell a ton of cheap items like that and rake in the cash. See, it's set up just like the blocks in a pyramid. So come on, invest! Join my party of infinite pigs! Eh. Uh, you cannot be serious. Wouldn't that only help the person at the top of the pyramid? Eh. Uh, friggin... You guys are sharper than I thought. 
I guess that was a compliment, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, just checking, just checking. Okay, can still do that necklace, but mm, it's not a necklace, it's a bracelet. Your merchant levels! Well, your ability as a merchant! As it goes up, you'll figure out how to redecorate or even expand your store. Heck, you might even be able to convince me to let you have a look at some of our more b premium items. So, how do you how do you simply rise your level? Simple. Buy, sell, trade. This is an art and you learn by doing. About the town. This city's getting a bit famous for the old ruins and the like that litter the surrounding countryside. So we've been seeing a steady th stream of adventuring types coming in for a while now. They're all here to try and strike it rich off of undiscovered treasures in the wilds, hunting for fat loot, they call it. Well, I don't know what they see in chasing it off after oversized loots, but their presence is has also brought a lot of new merchants to the city. I sure won't complain. Business has never been better. If you're looking for one, uh, um, uh, a few might be resting, uh, resting in the plaza. I bet most of them will take uh, will take to the city's biggest pub, though. It's never too hard to sell those wandering types a little bit of liquid pleasure. Even I go in there for a little nib every now and then. The more faithful <sighs> will probably hang out in the city chapel. We do get a few like that now and then on the pilgrimage or quest to find our uh, old holy relics. Uh, praise be to seekers and all that, of course. You might check the Adventurers Guild proper, too. They're in charge of making sure the exploration efforts aren't a total bedlam. They even succeed. Sometimes. Now, keep in mind that these places are only op open at certain times. For example, that pub op op only opens in the evening. We're pretty much open all the time, though. Wait. If you are always open, how do you find time to visit the pub? For that matter, when do you go home? Little Missy, if you had the kind of wife I do, <laughs> you'd be at work or in the sauce all hours. Two. Mad, forget I asked. Oh, that took longer than I expected. About unknown items. Now, if you go dungeon diving, you'll find a lot of stuff which you won't be able to identify at first. In particular, I bet you'll uh, I'll bet my hat you'll find a lot of what are called commonly mystery ingredients by the adventurers. At first, you'll probably be tearing your hair out over all the junk you keep finding in those places. But as your merchant level goes up, you'll be able to sort out the stuff you'll find and pick the best materials and whatnot from the lot. Oh, if you manage to get out of completely death traps safely, you'll have time to ad identify everything safely. That means you won't know what you're carrying till you leave, though. One more. Once a few merchant levels are under your belt, you'll be able to fuse items here at the guild hall. There's, a qu there's quite a few items you can only get by using fusion, so I'd get real familiar with that furnace if I were you, if you know what I mean. Remember, what you put in effects, what, what you put in affects what you get out of fusion. If you put in some materials of, say, plus two quality, then you will get an item of similar quality as a result. Keep an eye on that, on what you're fusing, too. You don't want to waste good materials on some mediocre thing you can just buy somewhere. Another thing to keep in mind, it can be real tempting to keep our best quality items to yourself for personal use. But your customers know quality goods when they see them, and you'll earn a lot of respect if you sell top-shelf merchandise. There's a couple of stages to what you can pull off with a fusion as you pick up some merchant levels. So experiment and be sure to come back here often to see what you can make. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I hope you enjoyed the episode. 
And I hope you are. <laughs> oh my god. I can't even. <gasps> oh, that hurt quite a bit. Oh. I hope you enjoyed the episode, and I hope I will see you in the next one as well. So, thanks for watching, and don't forget the very most sinister and important thing in life, my friends. Capitalism, ho!